Welcome to Halton's Fix It 101. Now, today we've got a slight treat for you in store. We're going to have a quick overview of these two here. Welcome back. Now, as you can see, these tools right here in front of me are from Evolution. Uh, they sent me these tools for a review um, because they are bringing out a new line of cordless power tools. I think they've already launched it, but uh, don't quote me on that. Uh, so they sent me these for a review and I've had a quick sort of look at them and uh, they have made some significant improvements over the last um, incarnation of their circular saw, at least. Um, as I believe, this is the first um, jigsaw that they've actually brought out as a cordless jigsaw, um, which I, I, will, I will review at a later date. Uh, but we'll just go over it today and have a quick look. Um, my 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 quick looks around it and everything else, I I've, I've found they are very very good. Uh, there's a lot of features that they've incorporated um, that that I find is very very good. Um, and I haven't seen on other on other saws either. Now let's just move that to one side a second. Uh, this one here obviously is the circular saw cordless. Um, now, if anyone has actually seen uh, one of my latest videos that I've done for Evolution, I absolutely slammed one of their uh, circular saws saying that they, well, you can watch it. I'll, I'll put a dedica dedication down below for it. Um, now, I actually slammed it and I said, you, you really need to go back to the drawing board and uh, do slightly better they have they've gone back and they've come out with this and this is a complete night and day but bearing in mind this is cordless up against corded but this is night and day up against what they previous incarnation of their cordless or the sorry the corded version of their circular saws for a start this one here has in, well, I noticed when I was putting in the blade, uh, there is a, um, a ring, obviously, that this lo the blade actually locates, but the ring actually comes off, so you'd be able to put different size uh, bore blades in here as well, and you can turn that around, put it back on, and you can, you can do that. I've never seen that on a circular saw before, so well done, Evolution, for that. Uh, there's... Um, uh, the, the, the guide at the front here is a fully adjustable so you can actually adjust it so you can actually get the blade in line with the, the mark on the front of the saw. Uh, there's better better over moulding on here. A lot, lot better over moulding. Um, even the sole plate. Now, this is one of the things that I brought up on, on, my, on, the, on that video is that they the, the sole plate that they brought out was pressed steel. They've obviously listened to what I was saying and now they've gone back to this lovely um, aluminium, cast aluminium base again. And it's a absolutely night and day improvement over what they had before. I, I, I'm well done for that. I really am over the moon, the fact that they've gone back to this because the previous incarnation before that one had um, the cast iron cell soul plate and it was a, so much better. So this is a, a, a back to what they had previous before that one and it's, they've gone back to that and it's much, much better. Um, there's a lot, lot better 
in here there's a lot lot better well we'll bring it up on another video but there's a lot better markings here for depth control there's the depth control is con con controlled by a lever that's here now instead of a screw that's on the back for depth control much much better improvement uh, there's markings on here to tell you for, for beveling um, which which is actually a good like tape measure um, that's actually on here rather than actually embossed into the actual steel which you, you can adjust and everything else everything's adjustable on here it comes with a knife it even came with a decent well this particular one actually came with a decent four amp hour battery now obviously evolution is not going to bring out a separate platform and everything else just because they can they've gone and these are compatible with the um Urbauer uh, platform that um, Screwfix actually make. Now, if you if you're on that platform with with Screwfix is Urbauer own make, then happy days because you can use their batteries directly on here, which no problem whatsoever. But the only thing about this is, and I dare say that evolution will bring it out at a later date this this is just the you know bringing a, a, a tool out this is not brushless this has has brushes but i dare say that they will will improve on on, on it over time and but for for what they brought out now this is absolutely brilliant and f and for what they, what it is absolutely good now I'll put the battery in now the battery is a little bit tight on that one but this one is okay but you'll also notice I'll, sw I'll, sw I'll switch it on just quickly um, that it has electronic brake it's start soft start and is to be honest with you it's not very loud either which is a brilliant brilliant machine now it comes with um, a charger this particular one came with a charger now the charger is another matter I put, put the battery into the charger and it had a fan in the in, in the actual charger obviously to charge charge the battery but to actually cool the charger at the same time um, I didn't like that feature because it it, it, uh, it is quite loud to tell the truth but as a, as a, as a tool uh, you know and everything else this is a very very good start to their uh, cordless range now they're in there and oh yeah there's another thing as well there's also a um, storage compartment on the back here for the allen key so you can go and change the blade as well so they have thought about things the rubber oval mold on here is such an improvement on, on the last incarnation of their of their cordless range it's even got over mold on the handle at the front which the other one didn't it is absolutely so much it's night and day it really is night and day so let's put that to one side a minute okay right let's have a quick look at the jigsaw now this jigsaw as i believe is the first cordless version of their jigsaw now it did come with some other accessories obviously it came with a with a guide so you can do straight lines but who used who uses a jigsaw to do straight lines that's why you have a cordless a circular saw or something like that to do do straight lines it has all the usual safety features like a button at the top here you push it across and then switch it on um, it's got the um, it has a um, Excuse me a lock at the front here so it's you can it's cordless sorry um what's name changing sorry losing me words so but there's other th features on here it has a lever at the back so you can change the angle of the bottom here as well and that just locks back in position and it's there the only thing i found about this quick just on a quick list uh, quick thing is the fact that um it 
it's a bit hard to get the battery in but apart from that you know it's, it's that's that's insignificant you know but I'll, it's good to have a nice battery and it locks in really nice and tight especially when you're going like round corners and stuff like that but uh you know it has four th four positions here for your um for your pendulum action um you know for for an entry level you know from from evolution i think they've done very well to try and get this again this is not uh brushless it's got a, it is a brush motor and again it's compatible with the urbauer system from screwfix it came with some um blades to go in it from evolution um so i think they, they've done very well now if you want to go and buy one of these if you like to go hop on over to evolution's actual website you can use my affi affiliate link which is holton's fix it 101 and to the end of may you can get a 10 percent off at the checkout so everything is here to help you guys out there that make the choice and everything else but i will be doing some more videos on uh, on these i'll do a dedicated video on each one of these so i'll be able to get more in depth and i'll have the camera up above so we can get more into it so anyway i will see you next time and uh in the meantime click on that like and subscribe down below and um have a nice day. I will see you later. Bye-bye.